Mailbag. As opposed to mailbag. That's right. Or mails bag. Or they bag. Or mails bags. Or Z bag. Ooh, Z bag. Z bag. Why does that sound like some kind of weird, I don't know, superhero? <laughs> Z bag. <laughs> Uh, it's Go ahead, let that you know sink that in. Much. Yeah. <laughs> How come it's Zed now all of a sudden? Uh, that's the way they say it in the other English-speaking countries. They're, we say oh. Z, they say Z. Really? Because it sounds Truth. stupid. Well, no, nah, I've gotten used to it now. No, I'm still. I have too, but it's still. <laughs> <laughs> so, for all of you in Australia and the American UK and elitist. the Commonwealth, I yeah. uh, I apologize for those of you in Canada. Screw you, you're burning, and you're making my breathing difficult. <laughs> Put yourselves out, be done with this. Put yourself. And never start on fire again until I'm dead. Stop it with the beans and the matches. That's all I'm saying. Who the? Do you not have Smokey the Bear up there? Hmm? No, yes. I'm looking at you, Canada. Do you not? <laughs> he only speaks French, and so most of the population doesn't get it. Oh, great. It's only Quebec cares, and they don't like yeah. us anyway. Right. Never mind I that. I love Quebec. Quebec. <laughs> Apropos of episode 646. Is Montreal in Quebec? Is it part of the Quebecian part of this world? I suppose. I think. Toronto? Don't know. Well, they're all East Coast, so. Toronto. Uh, I was at the Thousand Islands. Wait a minute, hang on. Hey, but, Toronto, sorry about your Maple Leafs. Yeah, right. Suck, better teams suck worse in my wild, so okay. AC <laughs> Silver. Uh, was in the at the Thousand Islands a few weeks ago. Thousand Islands is upstate New York, up by the border with Canada. Is that where they make that delicious um, orange-looking <laughs> stuff that could be confused <laughs> as baby puke, but you put it on a salad? Yes, uh, absolutely. That's it is. It, uh, and the Thousand guy, Island dressing. The guy that invented sriracha started at the <clears> Thousand <throat> Island plant. I have no doubt. So I'm my sorry. first carry on. This saw is my, bag, right? Come on. This is an AC silver. Uh, saw my first swan ever there. Remember when we were doing the stories about yeah. the swan? It was a whole family. Two parents swimming with their babies. I didn't know swans even lived upstate. Beautiful creatures. Those teens should be so ashamed. And I agree. Although, if you get close enough, AC, you'll find out swans are generally really yeah. mean and territorial. They are badass bastards right there, <laughs> they boy. Are. They we are. Had, I've been attacked by swans. In St. Cloud, there is what at one time was a lake, but it's still referred to as Lake George. It's right in the middle of town. Okay. And it used to always have these beautiful swans. Yep. And I get the feeling for a long time, teenagers would get too close to them because for a long time, it didn't have swans anymore. Ooh, yeah. So the only swans we had then for a while was just the cafe in Wade Park, but that's another story. It's a different story. From but the uh, food was tasty. I wonder if it was a swan. <laughs> yeah. This is a bigger than a chicken. I don't know. Um, Wow, that's See what a, the colonel can that's do. That's a turkey neck. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Episode 647, Patrick yes. Reed, our man in Liverpool. Vladdy. We were dealing with people's weird names. He once went to university with a guy named Richard Head. What foresight from his parents. That'd be the same as going to school with a girl named Colleen McCann. Wow. Wow. That's vicious. Is that true? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know if anybody I went to school with watches this, so I don't, <laughs> I don't you know. know. I'm, and by high school, all the jokes had worn out, and she was a sweetheart. No, good. She's a nice kid. It was a nice so, thing. So, you know, but yeah, I believe I graduated with her. Still, uh, it's still in 647. AC Silver. AC Silver. No, 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 no. Oh, episode oh, 647. Oh, okay. AC Silver says I had a co-worker named Harry Bowles. Yes, his parents did that on purpose. Where's it's the Harry Bowles? Lends a whole new meaning to warm and fuzzy, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, good lord. Even I feel bad about that one. Well, not really bad, but... I can just imagine his... Uh, let's just say I'm not proud of it. His sit-upon doctor. Uh, <laughs> Would it be like put-upon only? <laughs> slightly different? Sit-upon doctor saying, hmm, it's all warm and fuzzy. 
Doc, it seems to be taking a long time. I know something's not right. (laughs) I can't tell what it is. Did you swallow a Care Bear? Did you Did you eat a cat? I don't. It's a hairball in reverse. Uh, This. (laughs) What was that? You just gave me an image of a cat of a guy washing the floor and a cat bursting through the cat door, and uh, while the guy's washing the floor naked, and the cat goes. That's the image you gave me. I had no intention of doing that. Yeah, well, it's your fault. It always is. Episode six, episode 649. Yes. From our man in Liverpool, Patrick Reed. Laddie. The vibrating constipation pill. Yes, yes. That's reusable. <laughs> no, they take it to a landfill. Do they? Yeah. They do. Someone has to sift it out and take it to a landfill. Do they? <laughs> as far as we know. Dum, dum, dum. Oh, we're a, we're a Muller and Scaldy now. <laughs> Sculler and Moldy? That, yeah, you know, from the Z files, the <laughs> Z files. So we know about the little blue pill, Patrick says. This is the little brown pill? Yes. Yeah. That might be the best way of putting it. Is there a fur option? <laughs> I mean, can you get the pill with a fur collar? Sort of? Yeah, just have a cat swallow it first. And then swallow the cat. You'll be good. <laughs> it's not a problem. And you both get fixed. Apropos of episode 649 still, from my brother Chris Combs, no relation. Alcohol and... Didn't vi- take my medicine before the show. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Alcohol and that vibrating pill. Shaken, not stirred. <laughs> oh, that Bond man was cool. I tell you're gonna, you. You're going to bruise the booze in your colon. <laughs> I love that. Daniel Craig had the best line, though. Which was? Shaken or stirred? Do I look like I care? (laughs) That is a good answer. Yep. I like that one. So let's get off to the very serious business at hand. We do that? No. Okay, good.